be solving like the lead code assessment it's gonna be random two questions and we'll see how we do I'm not gonna be streaming today because I was busy but I'm still gonna be doing the assessment so yeah let's go to the assessment pick a random two problem and start doing it okay so the fir first problem you're given an array of strings word and string chars a string is good if it can be formed by characters from chars okay okay um so for this one wait a string is good if it can be formed by character okay okay Each character can be used once, and then what do we return to sum of lane? Okay, 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 okay. So we just need to figure out how many words there, are so that we can okay, okay. And then the length is less than a thousand. So for this problem, we're just gonna use Java. Of course, we're gonna use hash map. Or actually, I think we can even use um, a vector array, which is initially zero. Okay. And then let's go to where's the point. Out in the array. I mean, we're gonna. Should I do this in Java or. I don't know. Because I feel like if I do it in hash map, it's gonna be not efficient. So, yeah, let's just do it in. C plus plus twenty six zero like zero is less than char start length i plus plus and then the array that chars at i minus minus a plus plus and then at the end we can look through where's our size i plus plus let's just get the current string words at i Is less than How do we want to do this? Should we create a new vector copying the array or something else? How to copy a vector in C plus 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 okay? Go to this one. Okay, let's just do this fishing method. This is int copy equals array. Anchor dot length plus plus, and then we do copy it. Cur i minus a minus minus, and then we check if. If 
this happens, then we do... Cool, we returned six here. Now let's try it on this test case. And then if it returns 10, it should be fine. Cool. Okay, next question. You have N dice, and each dice has K faces. Number one to K. Give me three integers and K target. Return the number of possible way to. It's out of. K to the power of N total ways to roll the dice. I feel like this is DP. <laughs> so modulo 9 plus 10. So. Just do int mod equals uh, 10 to the power of 9, which is this, right? It's 7. Okay. Turn the number of possible ways. Okay. There is just one way. Okay. I feel like we can use, um, but then. I feel like we can use DP here. DP. Target is less than, okay. So. It's the length of N. Plus one. And then K plus one. Just. K plus one. And zero. This one should be vector and plus one zero. Cool. Now we need to set the base case, right? DPA at zero zero equals one. Now we loop through it. Equal to zero. J is greater or equal to K. J plus plus. Now the first option. Or we need to. Mm, this is target. And then that inner loop should be k. Should be 1. k is greater or equal to 0. k plus plus. dp at i j equals. Or actually, if j minus k greater than 0. DP at I J K plus equals DP at I minus one J minus K. This is not K. Something like this, right? And then at the end we can just return DP at and alright. 
and target. Yeah, let's try this. This is DP. Is there any other? No. Give us one. Okay, what if N is two, K six, and then target is seven. Sure, turn six. Okay. Now then we need to mod by P at I and J plus that and I don't think we need to return let's do 30 30 500 this should return like I don't know So it should be able to work. Oh, forgot that this should be depending on the value. Okay, so let's do R here. Okay, let's do R here. R, R should be minus R. Okay, and then if I'm right, actually, Tinsel Hearts, is this right? Plus seven. Okay. Hmm. Weird. What if I don't do modulo here? Overflow. We do long, long, and then modulo. And this should be long. Is it just long? Greater than this, so one, two, three, five, nine, and then here one, two, three, seven, nine. Yeah, it's supposed to be greater. Uh, let's just do long here and see. Yeah, overflow. It's definitely something wrong. Oh, because it's supposed to be R. Yeah, if that's the case, we don't even need to change this to long. And then at the end, just to make sure, let's do mod by. Cool, submit it. Finish session. Should be able to get a decent score. Here I got pretty good. 
I did bad in this one and then pretty good in this one actually. Didn't attempt this one because it was like construct literally. I don't know actually. It was BFS yeah. It was DFS. Yeah, it was like lexical order. I definitely need to know that. Because I didn't solve problems related to that, so. So that was like my first DP problem. And then. I actually think I never saw this. Number of dice roll with target sound. Oh, actually I did. But I, I think I did it in recursion, yes. Eight point six. Oh. Details. But yeah, overall, pretty good assessment. And yeah, thank you for watching. Bye.